सो हाई एवरी वन वेलकम टू तुंगभद्र नैटवर्क सो रीसेंटली वीक आलमोस्ट स मेबर्स सेलैक्टर मन कंपनी तरफ नीचे ने दादा सैवन मेबर्स सेलैक्टर अंदर फाइव मेबर्स मैं एस टीपीएल वा सो लास्ट वीक एस टीपीएल वे फाइव मेबर्स मन यूनो वी रेफर दम इंटरनल इंटरव्यू दूसरी रेफर फाइव मेबर्स सेलैक्ट अंड एक्सपीरियंस कैंडेट्स इंको इधर सेलैक्ट अंदर नवीन सो लैट कंग्राचुलेट हिम सो हि गाट सेलैक्टेड इन जेन्सर अंड वि पैकेज आफ फोर्टीन एल पीए ओके कमन मैन लैट कंग्राचुलेट हिम मैन कंग्राचुलेषन सो आल देस्ट ओके so what kind of questions they ask you can you please explain the pro- yeah. protocols and all so that it can be helpful for someone as well yeah. okay yeah thank hello, you for hello. yeah thank you for giving me opportunities and first uh, in the level 1 they have asked like uh, what is the difference between uh, firewall and the router okay. and uh, we can create acls in the uh, router so what is the requirement of firewall then so in the same way what is the difference between uh, l2 switch and l3 switch okay. that is the question they asked and coming to the point they have uh, touched basic like uh, dns part dhcp part and uh, arp address resolution protocol so have you explain everything at step by step packet level or step how step means uh, uh, they will ask a certain point of why we uh, we are using uh, arp okay. like that they will only definition part they are going to listen okay. and if they are going to ask uh, in deep uh, like adjacency process and all then we we'll ospf you mean yeah ospf adjacency process they ask and eigrp basic terminology like uh, what is uh, advertised distance feasible successor and successor what are the load balance how do you do the load balancing in the eigrp and what is the concept of uh, variance and these are the basic things they will ask all the d- uh, things are definition level only and once we are going to uh, osp of part uh, they will uh, ask like what are the packets we are using how many states yeah how many states will be there and uh, if there are two areas if you are uh, blocking the inter area routes what is the concept that you are going that is a stubs concept so like that scenario small small scenario based they are going to ask okay. so this is how l1 interview part is completed and what about l2 coming to the l2 part uh, they will ask like uh, what are the p1 issue that you have resolved yeah. and uh, what are the real time experience that you have and what is the uh, input that you have given in the p1, resolving p1 issues how challenges uh, you have faced in the real time environment based that on we your, covered in real time project yes yes based on your previous project and all uh, what are the real time experiences and uh, how you are going to be uh, facing the all these kind of issues critical and, issues uh, complex critical issues issues uh, based on the sla sla time is going on quality that you need to support within the very specific period of time in this case how you do troubleshoot the scenarios how you are going to achieve all these kind of tricky questions will be asking in the second round nat part you are able to answer everything right yes sir okay. nat part source nat destination nat will be there and nat overload will be there so that kind of questions they will asking as my experience previously lies with the security part so they are going to ask like uh, uh, firewall firewall part they have touched Check. so this pcnsc palo alto training helped you yeah so much it is uh, it is like uh, one of the basic foundation after having a uh, 6 years of experience in the networking domain only but uh, i am not able to uh, defend with the interview within uh, like uh, 20 to 30 minutes but uh, after completed training here i can able to answer like uh, uh, 1 hour 15 minutes 1 hour 20 minutes defending the interview in a, with a good note ended with a that is one of my biggest achievement i can say so i am very happy with joining the tungobedra networks and one of the best services we are getting here within a very reasonable prices so i would suggest each and every one who are interested in the networking domain and who are uh, starting their career in the networking field as a fresher or experienced in order to gain the stuff in the networking domain i am uh, one of the best and uh, prioritized opportunity to get with the tungobedra networks only i am very to happy to announce it thank you so much thank you thank you yeah so one final question what kind of suggestions see here there are a lot of experienced candidates what kind of suggestions you can give to them just suggestions uh, based on your experience here after you know during training what you have done to learn the things just your suggestions to the candidates okay my suggestions are uh, already what we are going with the very important points only in the syllabus 
coming to the original ccna syllabus it will be vast and uh, so as per that syllabus uh, we are not able to concentrate on important things and unimportant things as uh, our uh, organization already filtered the important things in the syllabus so whatever the syllabus they are providing us we need to concentrate on them and we need to uh, thorough each and every topic uh, from the packet level and the configuration part uh, labs should be mandatory for each and everyone with the theoretical theoretical part if you are going to uh, achieve luckily any opportunity in the production environment you are going to suffer like so you are not able to uh, perform in a best way so in order to uh, overcome that particular disadvantage you can uh, give the best means you go with the each and every lab uh, conducted by the tungabhadra networks so that would be helpful in your uh, onboarding process and after the project uh, requirement yeah. yeah so as i said right labs are very important every day so please do labs and success will come automatically okay so many have so many issues okay some people are struggling for job freshers experience non technical some people are bullying you you are especially your family members relatives your mamas right generally so only thing is success is a best revenge that's what i believe forget about native stuff okay so this guy done every every whatever the lab i gave him right every lab he has done every day okay he took help from from my candidate my uh, employees you know and network engineers internally so they he completed every lab now he is here within two months right within two months yeah within two months two plus months he got it uh, you know good job and congratulations man Thank so we'll so we'll much. we'll collab you know soon as well yes. so you know if you need any help in future also always welcome here you got id card right yes sir yeah so you always come here and practice it and yes, thank you so much again for your valuable words i would like to thank uh, our technical department uh, yeah. and i would like to uh, thank our technical department rajesh and varun and uh, recruiting department like uh, uh, varun and uh, technical department vinay they have supported me in each and every part whenever i get a doubt uh, from the company onwards uh, i used to come here and work on the things and uh, i got a good support from them so one of my achievement is a part of them only so i'm happy to announce it thank you thank you thank you for calling out thank you thank you man yeah